Saturday morning at the AES show in California. It's sunny outside and it's cool in here because of the air conditioning. <laughs> I'm on the warm audio booth with Chad. He's going to show me uh, the microphone which we have here, the WA87, which um, as the name implies is probably based on the characteristics of a classic microphone, which we won't mention at this point. So can you tell me how you've managed to do this at what I believe is a, a very low cost? Well, we've been working on this for quite a while. Uh, the WA87, as you said, is an 87 style microphone based on the original production version from the late 1960s. Um, it does have a Cinemag output transformer. It has our own custom K87 capsule made to the original specifications for termination, dual backplate, dual diaphragm, six micron. It has a PCB, which is component for component identical to the original unit. It has polystyrene, Wema film, antandalum capacitors, and Fairchild FETs. Um, as far as getting the price down, we have simply uh, worked uh, the economies of scale uh, in our favor to make a large number of these at once. We've worked out very good arrangements with Cinemag and with our custom capsule uh, shop. And uh, we don't make as much as many people do, but we love bringing things to people at an amazing price that they can afford. Okay, so in a side-by-side -side test with uh, with the microphone that inspired it, how different or similar does it sound? Extremely close to the same signature. If you are familiar with using the classic microphone, you'll find this instantly familiar to you, and it can be used in uh, many of the same applications. Of course, uh, the focus from the beginning was a perfect lead vocal microphone for the project and professional studio, just as the original was and still is. Um, and we wanted people to be able to buy more than one uh, so that they could use it on many things at the same time, say drum overheads uh, and many other applications that it does well on. Okay, so how are we looking for delivery times and pricing? We're hoping to have this in time for Christmas, uh, shipping in December, uh, we hope, uh, with a, a US price of $5.99. Sounds like a fabulous Christmas present to me. Stocking stuffer, absolutely. Thanks, Jeff. You're welcome.